It was 2015 when Steve was buying his first house and Stephanie arranged his mortgage for him. Steph was excited as she thought Steve was Irish and was later thus slightly disappointed to find out that this was not an actual fact case. She still is. She's still <laughs> I was just about to say, but she got over it because you ticked all the other boxes. Steve thought Steph was very professional and looked very clever with her glasses on. They're not really sure who asked who out or how it came about, to be honest. Suffice to say that Steph gave Steve her work number for business purposes, and here we are. So I'm not throwing shade, as the young folks say, Stephen, <laughs> but I think you were the one who initiated things. Their first date was at Cotier's in the West End of Glasgow, and it must have gone well because Steph really just couldn't get rid of Steve after that, so a second date was a no-brainer. Now, they were both smitten kittens quite quickly and initially they lived between their flats in Glasgow and Kilmarnock until Covid hit in 2020 and they compromised and Steve moved to Kilmarnock. At some point their thoughts turned to marriage. They don't need to get married, they have everything they need. They have each other, they have a home together, they have their families, they have their friends and they have the cats. But they want to and getting married is a public commitment that says to the world I want it to go down in history that I met this person and I liked him enough to want to spend the rest of my life with them. Oh 